Hello everybody, welcome to 54 Nights RV. Today we're doing a really quick walkthrough of the 2019 Airstream Nest 16 FB. That FB is for full bed. This thing is itty bitty. Thirty-four, four thousand pounds. You know, about four thousand pounds, I guess. Sixteen foot, seven inches long. <laughs> Sleepy capacity up to two. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is actually it's a fiberglass trailer made by Airstream, and <clears throat> I would guess it's kind of dabbling their toes in the Casita market, and it looks a lot like you know those little casitas and other trailers like it but like I said this is the full bed model so instead of getting the dinette at the nose of the trailer you've got that full bed and it's it's, it's like it's like a little base camp and the Terry doesn't come with it that's why she's outside <laughs> I like the windows around it. It's got curtains instead of blinds. It yeah. might get a little warm in the really hot climates. It's got a little bit of storage in it for such a small trailer. Got a sunroof. A lot of the Airstreams have those sunroof type things in it. And the camera won't focus in on the depth of that, but you get the idea. A little bit of storage here underneath the sink. Actually, quite a bit of storage mm -hmm. there underneath the sink. But a little camper, it sure is. A little refrigerator with the little cubby hole freezer up top. A little microwave right there. There's your uh, breaker box and a couple other controls there. Little cubby hole for spices and stuff, and a big old closet. I mean, really, it's it's a good sized closet for such a small trailer. You can pile all your stuff in totes and stack it in the closet. Yeah. And then, of course, your all-in-one shower. Is that a microphone? <laughs> Be shower karaoke, maybe. <laughs> It's one of those newer shower ones, but yeah, it, it's a a wet bath set up, which I mean you would expect in something this small. I like it for what it is. You know what it reminds me of? A towable class B. A towable class B. Yeah, like a class B that you can tow. Doesn't have a motor, but I mean, every all the inside is like a class B. Oh, I get it. <laughs> I don't expect you guys to get it, but I get it. So, yeah, yeah, it, it's a little bitty thing. I, Isn't that what it reminds you of? A class B. Think of a class B yeah, inside, yeah. and then, but it's a towable. Yeah, now you could. I'm trying to remember what the carrying capacity is on Jeep Wranglers, but I think you could probably tow this with a Jeep. And it's a this is a great weekender. Um, I mean, there's no place to sit and eat inside, but and that's what picnic tables are made for. I'm sure there's an air conditioner in there, right? Uh, you know, I don't remember seeing an air AC in there. Hmm. I'm sure there is. It's gotta be. Yeah. <laughs> we, we're so good at these walkthroughs. You have to put something in small print. all sorts of information. Yeah, small print at the bottom. Look it up. <laughs> Look it up for them. These people need to know. It's an Airstream. Um, good quality being Airstream. I, yeah, I, I didn't see anything to scoff at mm -hmm. on the quality department. So, If you take, take a few moments to check out the rest of our channel, we don't just do walkthroughs we also have other RV topics discussions or some of our road trips and learn from our mistakes yeah <laughs> and we make plenty of them we do that for you so, 
We'll catch you next time around, folks.